Hey guys, it's Colin from Tag. welcome back to another video. And this video is going to be kind of differently to what we normally do, and this isn't going to be a gameplay video at all whatsoever. And what it's mainly going to be doing is talking about the new update that has came to the Xbox 360 Minecraft Edition. Um, so with that, uh, it has been updated to the 1.7.3 beta release, which you have seen on PC quite a while ago, and I do have some notes written down here uh, just about it. So I will have all the release notes in the description of this video, so you can look at them all yourself. I'm not going to talk about all of them, I'm just going to talk about some of the main things that will be important to you guys and stuff like that. And I want to say first of all that I'm sorry I can't have anything on the screen right now that has to do with it, because um, I don't have a HTTP VR, my Dazzle doesn't want to record um, the Xbox, they work on... PS3, I don't know why it's not working on Xbox at the moment, so this will have to do for now. So I'd just like to say first of all that um, I don't want to get this confused with the Adventure update, which was beta 1.8 for PC, which like put in creative mode and uh, hunger and sprinting and stuff like that. So this is beta 1.7.3, which was just before that update. So I just want to say that first of all, if some people were wondering like, oh, where is sprinting or where's creative mode and stuff like that. So I just want to say that first of all. Um, so yeah guys, that's basically it. So I'm going to get into some of the things that are in the 1.7.3 update right now. So um, first of all, if you see in the starting part, there is a better update. There is a better uh, tutorial for, there's an updated tutorial, I should say, for um, pistons and stuff in the tutorial mode, which I'll have a picture on the screen right now of, because I'm sorry, but I can't um, show you properly how to do it, because I don't have a HTTP VR or anything at the moment. So um. It's going to show you how to use pistons and stuff. It's a piston bridge and it just shows you how to use redstone a lot better and stuff like that, which I really think is a better idea for them to put into it, which is really good. So um, next picture you can see on the screen right now is now you can allow friends of friends, which basically means if you're going into like a server or someone else is playing, if the person that's playing with you on their friends list, whoever they want on their friends list can join the game as well. So it's a friend of a friend, basically. That's the best way I can try to explain it really. Um, the next thing is there is now some custom skins now this is this doesn't mean you can use your own skin just that you have made by yourself or anything you can use the skins provided and you can download certain uh, DLCs and stuff like that for it that you can get so the skin pack one which I'll show a picture of right now is what you can use you can use some really cool ones like that so you don't have to use the plain Steve one or something like that when you are playing with it. Um, a couple of new updates with it so there's a better lighting engine for things like if you notice like say if you went to sleep and then it got to the day you can see like the lighting kind of lagged and stuff as it went to the day when you woke up and stuff like that so that's been fi fixed a lot to the 1.7.3 uh, update which is pretty good um some stuff they did add to the game and new stuff is obviously pistons because they do have the piston tutorial and stuff like that in it so that means you can get sticky pistons which i'll have on the screen right now so you can use sticky pistons so uh you just make a stick uh, a piston then you can put a piece or uh, a slime ball on top of it to make it a sticky piston um, so that does work. So now you have pistons and sticky pistons. You also have shears So that's used for now is you get wool from sheep with shears if you do hit them now It doesn't work you can't get the wool back You have to kill them and you have a chance of getting one piece of wool from them by killing them But if you get a shear you can get I think it's up to four pieces You're guaranteed one at least anyway from it And you can also use shears to get leaves from trees if you want to have them for yourself instead of breaking them and not having the block back You can actually get the leaf block Another thing you can do now is you can stack fences right now. So fences are now stackable. And like if you're wondering, it came in 1.8 where the hitbox was the shape of the fence. But like still it's the same as it was where it's the full block. So you can't walk alongside the fences and stuff like that, which you can do in later updates. Another thing added is now TNT does require redstone for it to uh, go off. So you can't just hit it now to make TNT go off. You have to actually use some red, some sort of redstone trigger to it, whether you just put a torch next to it or you make like a redstone line or pressure plate or a, a lever or something like that. So that is something that they have added into it now. Um, something they do add have n added now is redstone links to repeaters now. So like uh, it never used to work right before if you were doing things like that with repeaters. But now they did fix that problem properly and now it is the way it should be if you played the Minecraft on the PC. Um, some stuff they did add it now is now you can see the... If you're on the world loading screen, you can see the seed right now. So that's good if you want to show your friends. You can just go onto the, the loading screen and you can't see... Um, the seeds so you can tell your friends you can join the seeds together stuff like that i uh, see so yeah, guys that's pretty much all i have for now again if you want to see it like a proper list of everything they added i will have it in the description so you can just look at it yourself um so yeah guys hopefully you did enjoy the video i made this in kind of short time sorry if i missed some things again everything will be in the description like i tried to mention some of the main things that you guys would be interested in 
um so yeah guys if you did like the video please give it a like subscribe if you want to see more minecraft and just general gaming and so yeah guys i will see you in the next video